The Swine is on the line in Iowa City. The University of Minnesota Golden Gophers are hoping to beat the University of Iowa Hawkeyes. And to the winner goes the 98-pound bronze pig statue called Floyd of Rosedale. They're going to feel me today. They're going to feel me today. Nothing better than playing a rivalry game. But you got to believe and you got to be really confident. Do not let this team out there intimidate you. Don't let them intimidate you at all. You can't wait to turn it up. You gotta turn it up right now. You gotta start it off bad. Come on, ready? It's big time Big Ten football. Minnesota and Iowa for the 117th time. And the Golden Gophers are hoping to bring home the bacon from Iowa City. Well, there's the kick and we're underway in Iowa City. Back to the ground and he shot Williams. Bent in the backfield and dropped for a loss. Williams hit right at the point of attack and swarmed over there. No game. That was all the work up front, DT. That back spot down. The kick is up from Kessich. It's on the way. And it is good. And he made it by plenty. Kinds of trouble in the backfield. It was swarmed under. He is hit, drop the ball, it's loose, it's Minnesota football! Tyler Newman got it, Devin Williams poked it out of there on the blitz. One play at a time. Going on the far side, caught this time Daniel Jackson in a first down to the 30. Offers have moved it 45 yards on this drive, this will be the ninth play of the the first down, puts on a move inside the 35, got, so this will be a 44-yard field goal, snap back, spot down, the kick is up, it's on the way, and it is good, his second field goal is the blitz coming, and they lost the football, losing the football, and Minnesota's got it at the 10-yard line, a blitzing Newman forced the fumble, he didn't even go for the sack, Darrow, he went for the ball, knocked it out. Great year, snap back, spot down, kick is up. And it's right down the middle. Field goal is good, and Minnesota's within one. They have straight hand off left side, Keegan Johnson, and a good job by the Gophers to pursue it. Here's the pass on the far side, and it is through the hands and incomplete, and it's fourth down. Four-man rush over the middle. They'll need to catch in and run, and they get it. Big hit on Jackson, but he picks up a first down on third and six. We have played three quarters of football. We'll have the fourth quarter coming up. Iowa 10, Minnesota 9, and a key possession here to start this fourth quarter. To throw Kelly McManus. He throws it underneath. It's caught, and that is Taylor out of the backfield, tap dancing along the sideline, and a first down. There's Kelly McManus on play action, wants to throw. He's got Daniel Jackson all alone at the 30. He's got it on the stride. He's to the 20, and a big gain, 41 yards. And Minnesota in field goal range. Dragon Kessich trying to make his fourth field goal would give Minnesota the lead. This will be a 31-yard attempt from the left hash for the left-footed kicker. Snap back, spot down, kick is up. It's on the way, and the Golden Gophers have their first lead of the afternoon. 12-10 Minnesota. Three receivers right. Deacon Hill sacked. Sacked back there by Jalen Logan Redding at the seven-yard line. It'll be third and a mile. For Iowa, you can hear the Gopher fans in the background to throw. Pressure comes, hit, sack, back at the 38. Danny Stringle. Deacon Hill to throw again. Three-man rush, eight in coverage. Wings it near side. It's intercepted. Wally. There you go. Justin Wally catches it to 43. Minnesota will take over. 13 seconds and ticking down, and the Minnesota Golden Gophers for the first time since 2014 are going to get Floyd of Rosedale. It's hog heaven in Iowa City. There they go. And they've got Floyd of Rosedale over in the end zone on the north side. Minnesota 12, Iowa 10. And Floyd of Rosedale goes to Minnesota. the kids, players, staff, everybody came together, did something really special today. Uh, the resolve of this football team is inspiring. I mean, what they just did is unbelievable. There's so many emotions right now. I'll be lying if I said this game was one of the main, main reasons why I came back. It's so special, but something that hasn't been done in a long time. We haven't won here in a long time. 
And this is all, this is all I wanted today. It's a feeling unlike any other. I mean, the, a weight lifted off your chest, you know, a win for a team, you know, you see the joy on everybody's faces here, and there's there's not a feeling like that. No, no! This just means the world, not only to this team, this staff, but the state. I mean, this trophy hasn't been back to Minneapolis in a long time, and it's, it's going back with us tonight. Well, I'm just happy for our university. I'm happy for our state. I'm happy for our fans. Um, most importantly, everybody in that locker room.